Good morning, everyone. Today is Wednesday, May 31st, 2017. Welcome to our weekly Thoughts and Prayers Request video. Every week at Lilybug Lane, we post a Thoughts and Prayers Request video for our circle members, family, friends, and visitors. If you would like to be included in our weekly videos, please feel free to contact me through YouTube private messaging or at lilybuglane at gmail.com and I will be happy to include your request in our weekly video. If you have a request that is not included in today's video, please feel free to put it down in the comments section below so that our circle members and visitors can see your request and include you in their daily devotions and meditations. I hope everybody is safe and well today and we will get started with this week's list. Anna, who is only in my dreams in our circle of friends and also a fellow YouTuber, is asking for thoughts and prayers, please, as she recovers from surgery. We want to keep Shay, who is Hobby Doc Bay in our circle of friends and a fellow YouTuber, in our thoughts and prayers as she is recovering from illness. Also, there is her, some of her family that is traveling away from home. We want to keep Heather Thomas, who is in our circle of friends and a fellow YouTuber in our thoughts and prayers, as her and her family continue to recover from tornado damage. Tanya, who is the Frugal Cafe in our circle of friends and here on YouTube, is asking for thoughts and prayers, please, for her father and her mother. We want to continue to keep Myra who is Princess Disney in our circle of friends in our thoughts and prayers as she continues to recover from surgery. We also want to keep Casey Arwood, who is C. Arwood in our circle of friends in our thoughts and prayers as she continues to recover from a medical procedure. Kelly P-B in our circle of friends and also a fellow YouTuber is asking for thoughts and prayers please for her family and for her son-in-law, John, as he continues to receive treatment for cancer. We want to keep our police officers, firefighters, first responders, and EMTs in our states, regions, counties, cities, towns, and communities in our thoughts and prayers daily that they are safe and protected. We want to remember our military personnel, both here and abroad, as they selflessly serve our country and defend our freedoms. We especially want to remember Marshall in our thoughts and prayers. He is Lisa's son and is currently deployed in Kuwait. We want to remember our littles, our grandlittles, and our great-grandlittles in our thoughts and prayers daily that they are safe, happy, healthy, well cared for and loved, and safe and protected as they go about their school days, their extracurricular activities, and their play. We especially want to remember Joshua, who is Beth Graves' grandson, and we want to remember all of our graduates in our circle of friends. We also want to remember our animal friends, that they are safe, happy, healthy, well cared for, and loved also. And we also want to remember our country daily in our thoughts and prayers. So that is it for this week's list. Again, if you have any additional requests for thoughts and prayers, please put them down in the comment section so that our circle members and visitors can see your request and include you in their daily devotions and meditations. Thank you so much for stopping by. Please leave a message of support and kindness for those that are in need this week. Have a good day.